So the main reason why you probably want to get rifle grenade kills in Battlefield 1 is most likely, you know, because of the metal that asks for kills with rifle grenades, right? That's most likely why you're doing that. But maybe you just like blowing up enemies, I don't know. Nonetheless, man, I will teach you and I will show you how you can beast with rifle grenades, how you can get more kills with rifle grenades in Battlefield 1. So let's go and get right into that, man. One thing that I really do recommend that you do uh, before you start getting kills with the rifle grenades is you have to understand, you have to know what it is exactly that you're trying to achieve. And no, getting kills is kind of obvious. That's not what you're, I'm talking about. Like, think deeper. Perhaps you want to get a medal. Perhaps you just want to get a better KD, blah, blah, blah. Like, there's different reasons you may want to get kills with rifle grenades. You may think that it's more adequate. That's what you may think, you know. But uh, there's different reasons and you have to, like, find out what yours is so that you can better apply these methods and techniques that I'm going to show you guys so I'm gonna go ahead and try to make this video as quick and as informative as possible so when you start getting kills with the rifle grenade before you actually begin there's two things that you want to keep in mind and these are like the paths or the routes that you can take so to speak so more kills without worrying about deaths so that's number one you may want to get more kills and you don't have to worry about deaths and there's pros and cons to that one and then getting kills while keeping a good KD now you may want to go that route most people would probably want to go that route but there are some cons and of course a few pros as well and we're gonna go all over all of them so let's go ahead and get started with the more kills without worrying about death's route now this route is probably the best route or method if you want to earn a medal as fast as possible without caring too much about your KD or without you know worrying too much about your overall KD in this case you want to always equip the rifle grenades and constantly ask for ammo you want to make sure that you're asking for ammo constantly because you're gonna be running out of those you know rifle grenades you're gonna be running out of those fast man you're gonna be running out of those like nothing so make sure that you're always constantly Constantly asking for ammo so that you can get more of them all right now every time that you see an enemy use your rifle grenade no matter what it doesn't matter if they're right near you it doesn't matter if they're a sniper range you're going to die a lot that is a thing yes you are going to die a lot but also you're gonna get a ton of kills compared to if you were being more careful compared to the other route that I'm gonna show you guys you're gonna be getting a lot more kills this way so this is what I'm telling you if you don't care about your KD this is probably the way to go because you will get more kills faster even though you're gonna get a lot of deaths with those kills you're going to get a lot of kills as well so make sure that you're using your rifle grenade no matter what so with that being said man most of us want to learn how to use the rifle grenades and also keep a good KD now here's how you can do that I'm gonna show you guys so here we go number two guys getting kills while keeping a good KD all right now this is going to be a lot harder and man you're going to get a good KD but you're not gonna get a lot of kills I'm telling you man this is not the way to go if you want to go fast if you want to get the medals and and you don't want to care about your KD go for the first one man if especially for the medals do more than anything else the medals I really recommend the first one but here we go for the second one man in order to get kills with rifle grenades and as few deaths as possible man you probably would need to get into a smaller game mode and I mean a smaller game mode because it's easier to get kills at short ranges and that's what this is like the rifle grenade man it's a short range weapon that's what it is it's not a long range weapon it's not even a mid range weapon right I've tested it and I've used it I know it's a short range weapon more than anything it's the how that's when it's best it's best at a short range distance so make sure that you get into a smaller game mode I really do like war pinches and I really recommend war pinches more than anything I do think that Warp Pinches is the best in terms of small scale and you know the like, thing is man you know where everybody is going you know what everybody is after everyone is after one bird on the map which you know that allows you it allows you to get multi kills easier right because what you need to do is use your rifle grenades at the right time that's it guys just use your rifle grenades at the right time now the right time is when the enemy has the pigeon because when the enemy has the pigeon when the enemy has the bird everybody's gonna be around that bird all your enemies and all the their, you know, their teammates are going to be protecting that bird carrier as he writes the message. Everybody's going to be in that general area right there where that bird is and you will know exactly where everybody is. If you can get close enough and shoot that rifle grenade right onto them, you will get multi-kills easy, man. And what, you know what that's going to do? Even if you die, say that you get two kills and then you die, like you shoot your rifle grenade, you get two kills and then you die, you still keep a good KD. That's one more kill that you get without dying. You know what I mean? That's how you keep a good KD. 
and that's why this works because the fact that you know where everybody is and they're all grouped together it's the perfect situation you just got to think about it and it's not hard to think about it it's it's just you got to think about it you got to try thinking about it it's not hard you all you have to do is just throw that rifle grenade onto that group where they're at and you know where the bird is not only do you kill the guy with the bird and that allows your team to get the bird but you also get multiple kills around that enemy the people that are around that enemy that get to protect that bird they're dead dude and you get all those kills and even if you die right afterwards you you still got multi kills and your KD is still good. It is still positive. You know what I mean? Like that is why I recommend this method a lot if you're trying to get a good KD while you get killed with rifle grenades. Now, one thing that I don't recommend is that you go around the map just killing people with rifle grenades like just like nothing with no strategy, with no technique, nothing like that. I don't really recommend that too much though that you you will get kills, man. You will get kills, but I don't know, man. Especially if you're worried about your KD, like I don't really recommend that too much at all. Like, if you aren't worried about your KD, I guess you could do it if they're all newbies and you have some technique going. That's kind of like fits in with the number one thing that I said earlier in the video. But if not, man, I don't recommend it because it's going to hurt your KD most likely. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to drop a like and subscribe for more daily Battlefield 1 tips like this. And I'll catch you guys in the next one.